Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I'm going to try to help somebody tonight with a video to put words into a guitar body. And you see, this is a clip art because he's got a white background. You could bring in a yellow box and, and kind of prove it's a clip art with a fill that with yellow, go up to object, order, back a page, and you see the white box. So we're going to trace this guy just real quick. I'm not going to do anything to it, but outline trace and clip art. And then I'm going to say, okay, I'm not going to fool around with any of the settings. And then I'm going to left click, right click. And you see the shape. We've got a good shape of the guitar body. So now let's uh, click on it, go up to object group and ungroup it. And just try to grab this shape. There's actually must be double lines. Go up to object and break the curve apart, then take that body. Now we got a little bit of his neck to deal with, and you got to be careful not to uh, delete too many nodes to uh, mess with the shape, but we can get rid of that one and that one. And then just take your smoothing tool and ever so slightly, because if you remove too many nodes on the outside, and I'm just going back and forth. It, it could possibly change the shape of the other part of the guitar. So let's grab the shape tool again, grab those two nodes and see if, if anything's gonna happen. Didn't change it too much. I get rid of that double node and, and, um, and then don't have to do this, but I would smart fill it, move it out of the way and left click, right click, and that's how you could get, and you could do the whole guitar like that. You know, you could, uh, I might make, make a second video on how you could actually get the whole guitar, but if you just needed part of a body of a guitar, that's where you could get one. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.